Metformin is an oral anti-diabetic drug. It is taken in tablet form. It was first synthesised in the 1920s, but was forgotten for nearly 20 years as research interest shifted to insulin. Interest in metformin was renewed in the late 1940s, in, and in 1958 it was introduced in the United Kingdom as a useful medication for the management of later onset diabetes. It is now believed to be the most popular anti-diabetic drug in the world. Metformin is an insulin sensitizer. In my PCOS overview video, it was explained that this condition is associated with insulin resistance, leading to elevated blood insulin levels. These high levels have an adverse effect on the hormones that control the menstrual cycle. For nearly 20 years, metformin has been applied in the management of PCOS. There is an ongoing debate on its efficacy. They were assessed clinically and tests were undertaken to assess their metabolic and hormone status. There was no change in body mass index, that is to say that body weight did not diminish. Fasting and two-hour insulin levels fell. This means that there was less of a tendency to high insulin levels. Sex hormone binding globulin, SHBG, levels rose. SHBG binds male hormone in the blood and stops its activity in the tissues. And male hormone levels, particularly testosterone, fell. As a result, there was an improvement of hirsutism, that is to say, there was less excess body hair. This study has demonstrated a benefit with metformin.